one thing I love about working for Google Cloud is that we can bring amazing technology and make it accessible for the masses. Today is no different with Vertex AI Platform. Vertex AI Search and Conversation is set to redefine the way you build your applications with artificial intelligence. What if I told you we could give developers the ability to tap into the power of Google's foundational models, search expertise, and conversational AI technologies to create enterprise-grade generative AI applications, even if they've never touched the line of machine learning code in their lives. Vertex AI Search and Conversation does exactly that. It is power to the fingertips of your creators and builders in your enterprise to help you build the next generation of customer experience. We want you to easily adopt generative AI for your business to make each of your customer, partner, and employee interactions more effective, more personalized. But more than that, we want to simplify the process. With Vertex AI Search and Conversations intuitive tooling, the complexity of building these apps just fades away. But we don't want to stop there because we're also committed to preserving your privacy and security. Your data is and always will be yours. And we think that this is the fastest and safest way for you to build your virtual agents and search engines. So in closing with Vertex AI Search and Conversation, we help you build these AI-powered virtual agents and search engines with a simplicity and efficiency never seen before, all powered by Google's AI technology. Let's cut to a demo. So this is Vertex AI Search and Conversation. There are two components. Vertex AI Search, which I'm going to show first, and then Vertex AI Conversation, which I'll show as a second step. So first thing you'll see, this is our landing page at Vertex AI Search and Conversation, and there are different applications you can build. You can buy, build a search application or a chat application. I'm gonna go ahead and select Search and show you the first search application we can build. So we're gonna give it a name. I'll just call it Demo App, and we're going to build it. And then we can create what we call a data store. And this is where we're going to store your data. And now when we create the data store, you can see the various options on what kind of data we can actually index. We can index websites. We can index data inside BigQuery. We can also index data inside cloud storage, which might be in different formats, such as PDFs, HTML, your enterprise data, or JSON data that might be structured to store other data that you might have, say, inside another database. But let's not do that. For the purposes of this demo, I'd like to show you how we can use Google Search's web index to very quickly just create a application using your existing website. So I'm going to go ahead here and just index store.google.com, and I'm just going to finish the creation. So now what Vertex AI Search, and Search is going to do it's going to create that data store for that particular scope. And then it allows me to actually preview it. So let's have a look here at the preview of that application. OK, we get a search bar. Let's ask about a pixel, 7, 8. And boom, it just works. You can see here I've created a search engine based on that URL. And it works just straight out of the box. It's really that easy. So that's Vertex AI Search. Now let's talk a little bit about Vertex AI Conversation. I'm just going to switch to this other tab here. Vertex AI Conversation builds on Dialogflow, our existing uh, customer experience platform for virtual agents, and integrates these large language models directly into that experience, giving you much richer conversations with your end customers, but at the same time making it much easier for you to develop. Let's have a go and see the difference right here. I'm going to start the conversation with a virtual agent. I'm going to say, hi there. And now this is using the standard natural, you know, um, NLU, and it's responding with a canned answer. But with LLMs, we can do better than that. So let me just say hello to the bot slightly differently. Hi there. My name is Pac. How is the bot going to respond to this? Hi, Pac. How can I help you today? So with the power of large language models, it's detected that my name is Pac and it's injected that directly into the response, creating a very personalized response back for me. OK, now, with the data store that I showed you before on Vertex AI Search, I can do the same thing in my virtual agents to very quickly create very rich virtual agent experiences based on your enterprise data. Let's ask it some questions based on our actual documentation website for Vertex AI Search and Conversation. How can I build a chatbot with Gen AI App Builder. And we get a response back. 
okay, now something, something magical happened there. Let me explain what, goes, what, what actually happened. We've indexed the website. I've got this query. It's been sent to the data store. It's come back with a response for a particular web page that's relevant. Our large language models have summarized that article with a response there that you can see in these two lines and also provided the link to the actual document so I can actually see it for myself. So let's go have a look. Right, and highlighted even the content that's relevant, right? And that's an app straight out of the box with a couple of clicks. Pretty amazing, right? Let's ask us some more technical questions. What is a data store? So even when I ask it more technical questions, it's really able, with the power of our search engine, to actually pull out the right response and respond back very simply to a customer. Okay, maybe let's try something now a little bit more difficult. Let's ask if it can write some code. Can you write code? And for this, we're going to be pulling on some of our latest LLM innovations, such as Palm, to actually generate some code for us. Okay, I want to write some code for you. What's the objective? Code to upload a file to Google Cloud Storage. Right, so what's happening here? We've asked the virtual agent to create some code for us. We've called the LLM from the virtual agent, and this is a configuration straight out of the box with a feature we call generators, and it's returned to me code that I can use straight away. Let's have a look at the code. It looks pretty good. It's in markdown format. We're importing the right libraries, we're making a reference to the Python client, and we're uploading it. That's great. OK. What else can we do with LLMs? We can also summarize conversations. So let's ask it to summarize the conversation. OK. I'll give it an email address. Let's just give it a fake one. I'm a fan of Christmas. OK. And we get a summary of our conversation straight out of the block. Why? We're passing the entire conversation history to the generator. The generator is able to, the LLM is able to look over that entire conversation history and then give me a summary here. So all of these features are pretty much now out of the box for dialogue flow, and you can infuse that and use it in the ways to build some really new, interesting, creative, and personalized customer experiences with your virtual agent. Thank you very much.